What's up guys, c 13 here, and today's video is gonna be on the true output temperature of the Zero Breeze portable air conditioner. Alrighty guys, so to do this temperature test, what I'm gonna do is start the unit and let it run for about six minutes and then I'm gonna take another temperature reading. And I'm also gonna give you a temperature reading of the room. I'd say it's about 76, 77 in here, but again, once I do the reading of the outlet temperature, it's gonna be a better time to also give you the, the reading in the room, just to show you what's going on. Now obviously, I'm not exhausting the hot air outside right now, so I'm not trying to cool the room down. I'm just trying to show you what the ambient temperature is to show you how cool this thing can really get in the ambient temperature. In fact, I'll take a reading right now. It's about 76 degrees in here. And so what we're gonna do is start the unit up and I'm gonna let it run for about six minutes. So let's go ahead and do that. Alrighty guys, so the unit's been running for a little over six to seven minutes. And I'm gonna now show you what the outlet temperature is. Again, even now it hasn't reached the lowest temperature it will. I, I've usually found that it gets to its lowest temperature around 10 to 11 minutes. But first, let's take a reading of the room. And you can see the room is reading 76 degrees Fahrenheit. Now we're gonna take a reading out the outlet temperature of the zero breeze. And you can see we're getting somewhere in between 56 and 57 degrees right there. Again, it hasn't even reached the lowest it will. Usually I find or when it's around 75 to 79, maybe 80, it can get down easily to 50 degrees. If it's cooler, if it's only like below 75 if it's 70 you know about you know just in that range it could get down into the, four, in the high 40s so again I know a lot of you have voiced concern that you would say oh it can't get that cold because in your video you only showed it getting to 65 degrees well I only had the unit on for like two minutes so you got to keep that in mind guys it's an air conditioner and to get to its lowest temperature it's gonna have to run for a little bit to get the evaporator cooled down but anyway guys I hope that helps clear up some things and show you the capability of this air conditioner. I do know I'm also gonna be doing some future videos trying to do some comparative testing and usage inside a tent and how much it can cool down a tent in an ambient, a warm ambient environment. So anyway guys, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, give it a like. If you have any questions or any comments or anything you wanna say about this or any other tests you want me to run, leave them in the comments below. And if you want to see more, you know what to do. Get subscribed.